I've had amazing walking partners in China. Outdoor guides, educators, students, they are my teachers. Remember that old Confucian saying, if you walk along a street and you bump into three people, one of them will be your teacher. I say all three of them can be your teacher. 七月二十一日，中国公共外交协会在北京举办零甲七号沙龙交流会，邀请普利策新闻奖获奖人、美籍知名徒步旅行家、作家保罗·萨洛佩科讲述他的徒步故事。保罗在现场介绍，二零一三年一月，他从非洲埃塞俄比亚启程，开始了他的全球徒步之旅。计划用十几年的时间，沿着人类走出非洲的足迹，穿越四大洲，一直步行至南美洲的火地岛。他一边用自己的脚步丈量世界。一边记录下沿途的故事和面孔。So every 100 miles or 160 kilometers along my global route out of Africa to here, my GPS goes off. It goes bing, and I stop, and I do a systematic recording of that point on my walking route. I take a, a panorama picture of what the landscape looks like. I shoot some video, and I interview the first human being that I meet with three standard questions. Who are you? Where do you come from? Where are you going? The idea is that by the end of the journey, after hundreds of these waypoints called milestones, it will be able to be streamed together as a panorama of the human family. 二零二一年秋天，保罗来到了云南，开启了中国徒步之旅。他计划步行走过云南、四川、陕西、山西等地，直至中俄边境。保罗说，在中国农村的徒步之旅，让他感受到了陌生人的热情。So my experience of China has been largely rural, right? And like rural people everywhere, Chinese have a great sense of community. You know, they look out for each other. Somebody has some trouble, there's a neighbor there,、uh, ready to help them. I can tell you that、um, walking through rural communities in China,、um, people, complete strangers, have offered me warmth,、uh, hospitality, and indeed friendship.、Um, uh, In a way that is just like it's like a getting a battery charge, right? Even when I'm tired and discouraged, to help me keep going. So that's been one of the great, wonderful things about walking through rural China. Paul 表示，自己在徒步旅途中也看到了中国在帮助亚洲其他国家维修道路、建设桥梁，为攻坚“一带一路”做出积极贡献。But I've seen evidence of the Belt and Road all across Asia, especially right Central Asia. You know the. Big infrastructure projects where there are new highways connecting cities and there are railways, and it is to say that it's that it doesn't have an impact would be you know that's just you know inaccurate. Of course, it has an impact. People now have、uh, speedier access to to services and to to products. Paul 表示，他在中国的徒步之旅吸引了来自世界各地关注的目光。海外网友也纷纷表达了对保罗以全新角度发现中国的赞叹。Reader audience response has been. Overwhelmingly positive. If you look at like social media comments, if you look at comments that are responding on the website, it's close to 100% positive. I think there's something, if I may say so, something magical about the concept of taking a long walk that kind of diffuses people's defense systems. You know, kind of calms down their polarization because it's simply kind of. Wonderful in a certain way. I hope my stories are deeper, more meaningful, and remembered more, and accessed more by people across cultures and languages. 